and we're back you guys let us continue so last time we entered Shadow Moses now we are passing through areas that we were, were before got a call here I don't see any enemies around here okay we'll go through the door all the way at the back Otacon. Last time around, we had a few complications and wound up going through the commander's office in the basement. That's right. I remember now. But there's no need to go all the way down there this time, right? The back door takes us straight where we need to go. Mm -hmm. Good point. Okay, then. Let's get to the back door. All right. So basically, uh, this is the door that we need to go, but... Snake, that door is locked. How do I open it? Security is shut down altogether. You can't release the lock without activating it. You'll have to log in somewhere. I've got it, Snake. My old office is close by. With the power on, you should be able to unlock the door from there. And if you check the facility records, we can find out Rex's status and who's been in and out. You remember where it is, Snake? Uh, I've not seen it all yet. Just to be safe, I'm marking it on your map. You old geezer. <coughs> Snake, the password is 48273. Think you can remember that? I told you. I'm not senile. Yet. Well, it's still a pretty long password, so I want to have to repeat it on my head till we get there. <laughs> yeah, I didn't have anything. Snake. I've checked the APU on this floor and engaged the generator. Energy output is low, but it should be enough to power sure. the elevator. Try the elevator okay. and see if it's working. Yeah, so, um... <laughs> still thinking about the number. <laughs> I think I got it. So, uh, yeah, this same place. Uh, this is where, in the first game, they told you that they... Uh, made you unable to use your weapons, which is kind of weird, but they said that it was through the nanomachines that they did that because of the nuclear warheads that it was too dangerous for him to be shooting around here. And if the enemy spotted you, the clo the doors locked and all of a sudden a uh, poisonous gas uh, spread through the whole room. It was a really difficult room. I I'd say it was a one of the worst rooms in the first game. But, uh, yeah, I was pretty used to it, so that's why I didn't fail that much in, in my LP. Or at least that's how I remember it, because I don't know if I did fail. <laughs> so here's the elevator. We can't go through the, through the first floor basement. I think there are some flashbacks here. No flashbacks. Okay. Yeah, sometimes you get flashbacks on elevators. Okay, first go down the central hallway. Don't worry, it's not electrified. Tell anymore. me about it. <laughs> this is where you shoot the Nikita mi missile. Uh, you can't get into these rooms either. But you can go into that room over there. Let me uh, show you guys. <clears throat> That's the panel that I destroyed pretty cool. It's a really nostalgic area. I thought it was amazing that they allow you to come back here first time I was here. Everything looks exactly like I remember it. Except for that wall way in back anyway. I still can't believe how much damage you caused in such a small space. Ah, the switchboard. Nailed it with a remote control missile to shut down the electric current in the floor. The guidance system in those things takes up so much space, it hardly leaves any room for explosives. Didn't make much of a bang, huh? Hardly. Switchboard's still intact. You're right. The wiring past the switch circuits could still be live. Wait a minute. 
I'm not gonna get shocked if I walk on this floor, am I? No need to worry. As long as you don't turn the current back. You on. gotta note that down, because the first time I, I did this, I didn't know that you could do that little trick. And I'll be showing you that when we get out. Uh, but if you don't know that trick, it'll make this area like a lot more difficult. Pretty badass. <laughs> there are uh, ghosts around here. Let me get the camera. It's not something that really uh, matters, but, you know, it's kind of funny, I guess. Uh, uh, here it is. So you snap pictures, and as you can see, the people who make the game uh, put their faces around and stuff. I don't know where all of them are. And I'm not, I think you get some special things if you exercise the pictures. So, uh, yeah. So let's check out the cutscene. I hope I remember that. Uh, yeah, I do remember. <laughs> The, the only consequence you get by forgetting is that you lose a little stamina because he's kind of embarrassed for forgetting. Uh, I think this was it. <laughs> Yeah, I remember. If you hadn't shown. 
no help when you did. Uh, gives me the shivers just thinking about it. Snake, you saved my life. Naomi hated them for what they did to Frank's body. But it was me that crippled him in the first place. She must have hated me too. Nostalgic for the days when you needed a key card for every door. Yep. It's been nine years. All you really have to do is reinterpret the old technology in terms of the new. Getting old isn't all that bad, you know. <laughs> Let's get going, Snake. All right. I finished unlocking the door on the first floor. It should open now. All righty. I think there are more ghosts around here, but I don't remember where exactly. That poster right there is from the game Son of the Enders, which an HD version is going to come out uh, soon. And I'm totally going to be getting that. And I'll be, of course, pl making an LP out of, out of those two games. Those are one of the, my most favorite game of all time, and I never owned them. They uh, were... I borrowed them from a friend years ago. Those games are, are just amazing. Okay... <laughs> that phrase is uh, kind of funny. As if otakus are lonely people only. I forgot to take off the mask for for the cutscene. 
I usually like Snake to have some face time. Gecko. We've got Gecko. Gecko. Yeah, this is where I said that at the if you don't know what what to do, then it's pretty messed up. <laughs> I mean, it's not that messed up if you try and avoid fighting it, I think. Because all you need to do is call the elevator and run. Okay, so what you do is that you use the Mark II, or Mark III, I meant. <laughs> yeah, this is the new one, because the other one is dead. And now... Make that. Okay. Boom. Nice, snake. It's a one-shot thing. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. I didn't know this before in the past, and I tried fighting it, but, you know... What you can do, if uh, if you didn't know that, all you need to do is just call the elevator hide, and then uh, you know, when the uh, I leave, you know, you just can't fight that thing without any special weapons. I mean, you can shoot it in the neck and all that, but it's kind of difficult. And since the space okay, is so small, it just makes it a lot more difficult. You need stairs. Losing him now, it's going to be almost impossible. Damn it. Uh. Yeah, I don't want to do it like this. No, this is the whole problem. You just can't, you can't get seen. Come here. It only takes one hit for him to destroy the Mark III. So you gotta really try and keep it entertained. Man, my stress levels are going up. Oh! No! Get away! Come here. The Mark III. Do something. Uh. No, 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 no. Come here. Ah. I didn't know it could shoot at me while I was a little bit stunned. Pretty messed up. That's it. Come here. What the hell? It's like that missile disappeared. The Mark Three's been spotted. What? Ah, no. What the hell? No! Snake! What the hell happened? Snake! 
Uh, let's go at it again. Oh man, more gecko! The Mark III is totally defenseless while working on the door. You'll have to distract the gecko so they don't stop. Throw a little closer. There we go. Caught his attention. Over there. Yeah, go over there. Ugh. It's a big problem if that thing sees you. Oh, we'll throw a little further. Oh boy. Over there. There we go. Yeah, like I said, I could try and destroy it, but it's just so difficult. You gotta shoot it in the neck, and uh, I don't want to deal with that. <laughs> I want to be at 100% too, because we're getting close to a boss battle now. been hearing those lately, haven't we? <laughs> if it was up to me, I would eat it, and then I would have silence in my LPs. <laughs> Make fried chicken. Fried chicken. We're gonna keep doing this back and forth. There. There we go. It's more about the noise rather than the, the visual. He hears something and goes after it. But I only have two left and there are 40 seconds. <sighs> Come on, Otacon. No, that's too close. I didn't want him here. Let's see if we can... Once he starts moving, it's when he'll attack the, the next one. open. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, so I'll be stopping here and I'll see you guys in the next one. I think I can... Okay, this is a good spot. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.